Hey guys, it's been a really long time. Um, I just thought I'd make a quick video, and uh, just because I haven't in almost over a year, I think. And I just wanted to show you what my hair is doing nowadays. Um, as you can see, I don't have any, um, I haven't done any dreads or anything like that. I have one in here that I kept um, from, I think I did it this summer, but just decided to keep this one. So I've got little, little things in it. But yeah, I just thought I'd kind of show you. My hair is getting really long. I'm actually growing it out um, as long as I can. And then I'm going to cut it all off and donate it uh, to Locks of Love. My aunt was diagnosed with breast cancer a few months ago and she's going through chemo and all that stuff and she always used to donate her hair um, and that's what I've always done too because I just have always looked up to her for um, for doing the, that kind of thing so that's what I'm gonna be doing it's gotten really long and I mean it my hair is naturally curly so you can't really see how long it really is but like it's pretty it's pretty long, and I cut it myself. Um, I don't go in and get it cut, so like the layers and everything, um, I just do myself. Anything I can do to save money. <laughs> so, um, yeah, that's my hair. I've been thinking about doing a video on uh, natural products, um, natural beauty products and stuff, because over the summer I took... Um, all my all my stuff like shampoos, um, deodorants, hairspray, and all that stuff. I got rid of it gradually and replaced it with um, healthy, more natural alternatives because there's a lot of really nasty chemicals and things like that um, that aren't good for you. They're actually toxins, and um, your body has a hard time processing it and it can cause cancer and illnesses and all kinds of stuff because your body absorbs it and has no way to get rid of it. It doesn't know what to do with it. So um, I've been using a lot of coconut oil. I've been making my own deodorant out of um, coconut oil and beeswax and arrowroot powder and all this different stuff. So I was thinking about just showing you guys what I use. I also am making my own um, what do you call it? I can't, that is stupid, I can't think of the word. Uh, laundry detergent. <laughs> I don't know why that was so tough to come up with. Um, so I also make my own laundry detergent now and it's so cheap and you can save so much money. So um, if you're interested in me showing you guys what um, what I've made uh, and how I did the process and whatever um, and maybe sharing some of my recipes I'd be open to doing that so just give me some kind of feedback and um, if you'd be interested in a video like that um, there's a lot of really cool things out there that you can use instead of um, instead of nasty icky chemicals that your body doesn't like so I hope everyone is doing well and I can't wait to hear uh, what you guys comment, um, what comments you leave and stuff, so yeah, I guess I will see you later.